What's up, everybody? I just woke up, man, and it's time to get into some Disney Dreamlight Valley. Nah, I just did wake up, so I got that pop smoke, you know what I'm saying? Baby, come and meet the woo. Watch how you speak into. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I guess some pop smoke shit going right now, but it's all good though. It's all good. You know what I mean? It's all good. We in there doing the pop smoke thing right now. RIP pop. You know what I mean? So check it. This is what I did. This is what I did off camera. Wait a minute. It's a little early. So let me go ahead and, uh, we me mess with my time just a little bit. So it's a little bit brighter. Yeah. Okay. 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 So this is what I did y'all. This is my house area. Now I know a lot of people are saying they put their house over here and I saw a couple people online. By the way, I'm going to need all of y'all to really go crazy crazy on Twitter and post like pictures of my videos and just stuff about me on Twitter to Disney because they be retweeting a lot of people man and you already know like some of my designs is actually some of the best in the world I'm just saying between me and you we got a little community right here and I want to make ours the strongest Disney community on here so I'm gonna need y'all to post some pictures but I seen a lot of people put their house over here but I ain't never seen nobody go as crazy as I have you see what I'm saying so this is what I did off camera I basically really made the yard uh its own little thing so remember I was telling you about the trellises kind of like to make the backyard separate from the courtyard well that's what I did so I pulled this around we got our little oasis over here to the right to the left we got the gazebo with the uh the little fish picnic table and then I just went crazy with the details like I added the clock tower I just I widened this all up so now it's a lot bigger and it just it just feels and looks like a real rich courtyard you know what I'm saying I put a couple bikes over here because you got to have a, a form of transportation you know what I'm saying so we put the little bikes right there and it's just looking amazing man it's looking amazing you know what I'm saying Papa Perk feel amazing <laughs> not for real though so it's looking really good but that's not all we did I was, I was I'm still playing with the idea in this town because I, I don't know what to do man like by the way my dude is looking like he works out for a living I, I've been trying to get his outfit together I'm just trying to come up with a summary outfit but it's not really it's not really hitting for me right now so let's switch to Disney Bay Disney Bay got the formal stuff on because we live in rich right now see Disney Bay thinks she a princess now you know what I'm saying which she lightweight is I'm not gonna lie so she could walk around wait you could hear her feet hit the ground that's crazy so so basically I got Mickey and Minnie right over here with me so Minnie got a little house and Mickey got a house I don't know if I'm keeping them there I do kind of like them like that because it makes it like a little bit of neighborhood vibe and these are like the most royal Disney characters in the game so I was gonna make them a nicer spot but I think that giving it a little bit more of a neighborhood feel I might keep them there Cause Goofy is staying by the pumpkin patch and I'm not sure what I'm doing over here this is another spot I've been trying to figure out I don't know if I want to bring Remy's over here with the apartment complex and make like another little plaza let me go up in the air and show you what I'm talking about when you look at the map I'm really feeling my area this is a great area for the castle I think that's why a lot of people used it because it really is a great area I could also see myself putting it somewhere like uh, down here too if you wanted more of a summary. But uh, the plaza is a mess again. I tore up the plaza. The plaza just can't win, man. It just can't win. It's because I don't like I don't like buildings in the plaza all like that no more. Cause everybody does it. Like I really don't want to look like nobody else's valley. So whatever everybody does, I try to like stay away from it and do something different. <clears throat> like everybody has had the store and Remy's right here in the plaza like that's just kind of where we started at which was cool when we started but I'm trying to break off into new ideas so I was thinking about making them something right here but I just I don't know man like I mean when I think about it it could look kind of cool as in like a little what do you call it like uh what is this style it's like Paris it's kind of got like a Paris look to it so like that kind of villa european i don't know what you call it that kind of look i could try to like build up this little block right here like that i don't know how i would do that because it's not like a whole lot of items that look like that but we could try you know what i'm saying we could definitely try and then you got uh that's why i think mickey and minnie look cool right here because it's just enough space i never did finish doing this little picket fence neither it's just enough space right here where you can make it feel like they got a little yard 
You know what I'm saying? They got a little yard. They kind of share it together. I was having a hard time, though, with this store because I like the store here. I love the store here, actually, because when you walk out the house, you can see right up the road and see what's in the store. The only problem with the store being right here is that it takes away from this area here. And it also takes away from this area here because the way I had this was the store was down here and it was kind of, I was like, I was going to build this up and make it like really dope. And I was going to do that. But like now I'm looking at it and I'm like, do I really want the store that far away from the rest of civilization? Like we just tore up this area and now I'm building it back up. But I do like the way I'm building it up this time where it's more residential. It's a little bit more still foresty, which I do like that. I could add a little bit more of a foresty feel to it. I just want it to feel more like a community. But then at the same time, I don't like this long grass, stuff like that. That's why I've been doing a lot off camera because I've been spinning this camera around trying to figure stuff out for hours. And then up here, you already know, we're gonna do like a little Christmas area in this pocket right here. But then over here, I think I'm gonna take this stuff up. Lead a church, but I'm gonna take all this up and maybe do like a more open, maybe a little path but not really nothing crazy on this side that way you got a little path going to the cave and then we're gonna go christmas crazy right here which will stay all year round and then that's another thing about the store like it seemed like every holiday i want to move it but i'm hoping i'm really hoping the more and more they launch different skins for the houses and they launch different villagers i won't have to tear everything up to move everything to another spot like right now i got mickey and minnie over there but i got goofy over here and goofy chilling with the with the pumpkin vibe which i don't know if i showed y'all these keep popping up they, they popping up a lot more often than usual i'm making goofy's house the farmhouse because it just fits too well it really just fits too well and then we got wally's garden over here right next to the pumpkin farm it's a mess over there right now but this is gonna be the whole farm area right here and then of course scars area is fine it just needs cleaned up right now and then on this side of the bridge this is where i don't really have no ideas i did notice you could put maui spot right here which is really unique <laughs> i don't think i've ever seen anybody put maui up here you could i don't know if i would or not and then of course, Eric is in the corner, which Eric is probably the most AO character in my opinion. He doesn't really have personality, so I don't even know. I mean, he's like a prince. So being up in the cut by itself, I mean, that's that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'm just trying to get like a idea of what I'm doing so then we could go crazy with the decorating and really like, you know what I'm saying? Put the effort in and making it dope as hell. And that's why I keep tearing up the plaza because I feel like all I do in the plaza is the same thing over and over again. I gotta really come up with some unique creative ideas for the plaza that haven't been done yet. Same with down here. It's like nothing down here now. Like I told y'all, man, you gotta tear stuff up sometimes to go forward. Like I need to start thinking of different stuff. Like maybe Moana, as crazy as that is, Moana's boat can really go anywhere. So you could put Moana's boat right here. You know what I'm saying? Like it don't have to be so traditional and how you do stuff. Now, it don't really make sense being up there, but so let's just go on the uh, furniture and let's just see some different ideas that we can do over here with the restaurant. Because I really want to give it a nice little Paris kind of feel. And I don't know exactly how we going to do that. So we got to try to just play with ideas and see, is there any way we can do that without being too samey? You know what I'm saying? I don't want to be samey. What the hell is samey? Samey is like, do what everybody else do. I don't want to do that. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to do that. I definitely want to get something different going. This fountain is so big and it would be so nice right here, but you know we can't do it. It's just not going to work. Could you do gazebos? I'm just trying to get an idea how we could really like make this look. I do like doing this though. This is one thing I definitely noticed I like doing. I like adding these to the border because it really makes the sidewalk feel like a, a area. You know what I'm saying? So I might do little details like that is definitely something we're going to do um, after we figure out 100% this is where I want to put this. I just need more like French type stuff. You know what I'm saying? French design. French designs that are also like that villa look. I guess I could do a four square. These bush things are really, really important to design, but I don't want to go over the top with them either. Because I mean, that would be like four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of these. Just boom, boom, boom. That might be OD. I'm not going to lie. That might be OD. We got a little food stand. Let me see. There's another idea I wanted to test out that I was thinking about, too. And that was moving the store 
out of there and moving these two buildings next to each other and creating like a a little area up where the story is right now that's another idea i've just been testing a lot of stuff out trying to figure out what exactly is gonna feel just as good as it felt before because you know we're gonna have to do an updated valley tour and we can't be out here looking like we went backwards you know what I'm saying? we can't be looking bad out here so we got to make sure everything we do is an improvement not a deprovement you see what i'm saying so let's just move the store let's get the store out the way for a second right, just move the store out the way see like how we feeling about something like these Kristoff got some iron that's always a plus well that's in the way right now but if i made this whole area i had to move these night thorns but if i made this whole area like a but see that don't look too bad y'all that really don't look too bad if i built that up now imagine that being built up though and in the store it's still being the big commercial area it is i mean i really could do whatever i wanted with it to be honest but we could build here never seen a store right there before well this is we're in a creative phase so let's save it let's save it and go down okay disney bay you walking around looking rich i feel that this is the only dress in the game that has this animation i think i do like the fact that when you come across the bridge scrooge is, is like right in your face i do like that with enough trees and stuff and then down here you got the little eatery area let me get this iron real quick before i forget this is a unique idea <laughs> christoph be acting crazy when you buy uh this is a unique idea though i, I kind of like this you know what i'm saying i kind of like this let me get these night thorns and stuff out from behind this i don't know if they, they if they changed something but i think they did because these these stubs and stuff never used to spawn after you pick them up now they spawn everywhere which i'm not mad at but sometimes they just be in the most awkward position and it really messes up your design but it's all right for right now we're gonna test this out so if we go in in the middle do we want che cheese remy these can go back pretty far too do we want them like that which is kind of cool or do we want to center it damn what if we made a plaza a plaza a plaza is kind of cool though i ain't gonna lie a plaza is kind of cool it's a little it's a little extra it's a little extra i'm just thinking of trying to think of unique ideas a little plaza over here huh that don't that don't that don't uh don't feel bad to me though i kind of like that this is why I, I, we really need some more buildings though I mean, I know they're working on it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't rushing them. But just this will never be complete in my eyes until we get probably at least 10 more buildings. Because it's just, I want my stuff to feel tight and city. City-like. City-like and tight. You can make your own jokes on that. You know what I'm saying? I do like it to feel tight, though. Because the tightness of the design makes it feel lived in, cozy, warm. You know what I'm saying? All the things you feel when something is tight. And you could take what I'm saying in any direction you want to take it. But I'm just saying, when it's tight, it's, it's right. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> when it's tight, it's right, yo. That's what I'm going for here. That's what I'm going for. I'm going for that tight feel. I did grind some uh, materials, floor materials off camera. I still don't have enough though, so I had to take some from the plaza or take the whole plaza up. I'm just looking to see something. How does how does all this feel? You know what I mean? How does it all feel for real, for real? Because this would have to go over a, a substantial amount. Let's just go down and look. Let's go down and look. Matter of fact, hold up. Let's try one more one more idea real fast. One more idea. By the way, y'all y'all on this Disney heavy man. I love y'all, man. Disney get more views than anything else on the channel, bro. That's crazy crazy i mean that's good though don't be sleeping on the other games though i ain't gonna lie don't sleep on the other games i ain't mad at you because disney is fun very fun i'm just seeing if i can make like a little market area y'all know i love to put the stalls right about next to the store i just think that's like the way it should be that way you got your full shopping experience like a little town shopping thing i like that i like the feel of that like your little market district mark ass brownie you know what i'm saying your little mark ass brownie district all right let me see let me see let me go down okay let's go back let's go back go back a little bit since we building and we not in like rich girl mode <laughs> let's see if we can put a different outfit together real quick we got so many dresses yo like if you don't have a girl character you gotta make one and if you ain't got a dude character you gotta make one you gotta have both man it's just so much more fun because you're able to 
like really embrace the character like i've seen a lot of dudes they play the game and they just put their dude in a dress it's like why don't you just make a damn girl character bro it's so much better you know what I'm saying the female physique is just a, a whole nother art of work you see what i'm saying like you gotta you gotta appreciate it i like this little dress right here this little thing right here looking nice i ain't gonna lie this little thing thing right here now we got the mini ears or we could go with the little cat ears. Now I'm into the uwu streamer look, I'm not gonna lie. I like me a good uwu girl, but I think we're gonna go with the mini for the Disney, for the Disney effect. I think we're gonna go with the, with the mini. The shoes, didn't I have on, didn't they have, uh, they have on socks before with this? Oh, they do got the thigh high joint. Question is, do you see them when she's running? Oh yeah, you do. That's actually a good look, but I think it's too, it's too, uh, it's too much right now. <laughs> it's too much right now. I think that's cool. That's what I had her in before, I think. But it's like summertime now, so we ain't doing the winter look. Let's just do the black joints. Let's just do the black joints. Black joints, no sock. And can you see her bracelets or nah? Oh, damn. They take them off. Damn. This is my favorite one, too, because you got a bracelet and the other, the, I mean, the left and the right wrist. The rings and she got nails. It's, it's, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of a struggle to get it right. Let's see if we got a different fit, different fit. It is summertime. We could go back to the red. You gotta be able to see the jewelry though. This is a good one. This is like, take your girlfriend to Disney World type vibe. Take your bit to Disneyland. Uh, well, I feel like this camera ain't got no life in it. Give me some life, bruh. Is this the life button? Yeah. Give me some saturation. I kind of like to take your girlfriend to Disney World vibe. Ooh, but this orange? That matches the orange. That orange matches the orange on the bracelet. And we could find something hat wise. I swear this this <laughs> this girl can pull off any look, yo. Get you a girl that can pull off any look, yo. I'm just saying she really can though. She really, really can. We got the orange. This is looking too Halloween-y, ain't it? Yeah, this is looking mad Halloween-y right now. I like that cowboy hat. And I ain't never been into no rodeo hoes, but like cowgirl look on Disney Bay? That hits. I'm not gonna lie that hit. She got the little rag, the little bandana. I'm not a fan of this one. This ain't giving no hair. I like this one though. This one cool. We got the new chrome ears. I got so many outfits to choose from. <laughs> it's hard to just pick one because it's so many different looks. Oh, they got the white shirt. See, this just remind me of Tiffa. That white shirt with the black shorts is just like that Tiffa look. And if y'all know anything about me, you know that I love Tiffa, yo. Tiffa from Final Fantasy VII will always be Bay in different variations. It's funny because you can have a black Tiffa, an Asian Tiffa, a white Tiffa. Any Tiffa variation is always Bay. You know what I'm saying? It's just something about the Tiffa character that's just like, it's just Bay. You know what I'm saying? Why we try something different? We got this like a 90s look. I kind of like the 90s look though. I'm not going to lie. Maybe lighten it up a little bit. Lighten it up. Not the boy shorts. And that's all we got for shorts. Got red, the blue. I don't know what those are. These are like a pinkish color. I mean, those ain't bad though. This is not what we supposed to be doing this video. I know. I know. <laughs> We're going to get back to what we supposed to be doing. Just give me one second. Let me just pick a fit. Pick a fit. She look like a mom now. But I ain't going to lie. She was my girl. She be a mom. <laughs> I just said. Hold up. He ain't got no like. See, I want a pair of these. I like these. These is lit. These is like next level. I love the futuristic shoes. This is just something, just something different, man. I just want to go with something different. Not necessarily a W outfit, but it's just different. It's more like, let's just chill at Disney World type vibe. Damn, it's about to start raining. What about this little bag? Got the little pink one too. Why not go with the green for Monsters Inc though? The green match the green on there. It is what it is. I'm probably going to change it in probably five seconds, but let's just get an idea of what we did. So this is like a whole little market down here. I do like this idea though. I like this a lot more than I thought I would. So you got your little residential, got my castle, mini, Mickey. I don't know if I'm gonna keep Buzz's truck right here or not. I might park that somewhere else. Maybe over there in the uh, little cut right there. And then down here, you had a whole grand shopping district. I do like this idea a lot. I'm surprised I never thought of that. See, I needed y'all with me. I needed y'all with me. 
I do like that though. Now before we lock this into place, before we lock this into place, a bird's eye view. Cause what I'll probably do too is like, you see how I was trying to curve that in? Well, instead of doing that like that, I'll probably curve it out because I want this to all be included in that. Those are all, all those are all after the fact type things anyway, but I just like to think about them now, just like the pillars. The pillars are very much an after thing, but I like to think about it now because this takes a long time to get this stuff perfected. So when I'm tearing it up, I gotta make sure I'm, I'm making W decisions. That way I don't make L decisions. You see what I'm saying? Cause I don't wanna tear this part up again for a while. I would just rather add to it. Like right here, let's remove all of this by the way. I love these balloons. I just really wish there was more like stuff to do with them. Like I kinda like them like grand opening type vibe, but they just too big. They just too big. So I really don't even know where to put them. So I just set them somewhere. Then we got the spaceship, the gazebo, all this type of stuff, which I don't know. Maybe the gazebo. No, nah, we ain't gonna have no room for that. Maybe, maybe. Nah, I doubt it. I was gonna do an outdoor eating area, but like I told you, I'm not really a big fan of like unrealistic type builds. Like when people put like real stuff outside, like couches and TVs and food and like cloth things. I don't like doing that. I didn't like doing that in Animal Crossing. I definitely don't like doing it in Disney either because it just makes it feel like clutter and unrealistic. Like even something like this, like this coffee and book sitting right here that doesn't feel realistic because it's like, why would you leave that outside? But it takes you out the immersion or at least it takes me out the immersion of this being a real place. One thing that I'm not a huge fan of on this area is this left side. I like the right side. The left side is just like, eh, cause it's a swamp. It's kind of like, not a swamp, but like a river. I need to like lighten it up. Maybe if I added bushes and stuff like that, maybe like this, that would help. I think that'll help, but that's after the fact stuff. Once we lock the design in, we gotta lock that design in before we start talking about <laughs> bush work. What the hell is bush work? Bush work is when you work on bushes, you know what I'm saying? Water tower or no? Nah, I'm gonna say no. I don't really have no place to put these water towers. I I think I'm gonna make them part of like the amusement park when we get the amusement park stuff next uh, star path. That's why I think I'm gonna really hook up the plaza too. I think I'm gonna make the plaza like an amusement park or maybe make the amusement park down here. I don't know. I know Starlit is locked. Starlit is locked in. I was just thinking, I'm not gonna do this cause I literally just put this here. I was just thinking, could you actually build up a nice little plaza right here? You actually could. You just gotta worry about these lakes. But at the same time, the stairs from down there will go right into the back of your house, which is kind of weird. This is another good spot for that though. It really is. I'm leaving mine there though, but that is a good spot. Yeah, I like this. This is basically what I did up here, but I don't know why when I took it from up here, I just never thought to do it again like this. Cause I do like that. The three tallest buildings, boom, boom, boom. It's all like residential looking, even though this is, I mean, uh, commercial looking, even though this is residential, it still feels commercial. See, I think I'm gonna move Buzz Lightyear over here. I think I'm gonna move him right there, but not yet, not yet. All right, let me pave this off and let me just really get an idea how it's gonna feel because it might not feel that great on this end. I hope it does, but it might not because this end is a little strange the way it's set up. Okay, so this is the kind of energy we getting right now. Another thing I like about this idea is that this is back. So it starts low, gets up, goes back in. I like that because it makes it where it's not like in the middle of these steps. These steps look like they're realistically like cut away. You see what I'm saying? I know I'm not really saying nothing, but you know what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You see with your eyes what I'm saying with my mouth. You see what I'm saying? You can actually see my words. And then on this side, we're gonna do the same thing. Take this down, pull this down, take that up. And then like I said before, I just start turning this in. Something like this, where I just kind of turn those bushes to come into it. That way it looks more like it's natural, but I still keep a little bit of space. I'm gonna have to move this tree probably. Yeah, see, I, I like that, I like that, I like that. I think we I think we on a, on a, on a path to victory here. Let's go down and see what it look like. Hopefully this rain goes away. I think we on a good path right now. This does look like a rainy biome though. It definitely looks like a rainy biome. See what I'm saying? Disney Bay can pull off anything, bruh. 
You see that? You know what I'm saying? I love this look. I actually, I actually like this look better than the other look. It's a little suit, little worker bay. You know what I'm saying? So this is the plaza. It finally stopped raining. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna lock this in, man. I like this. I like this. It's a lot like it was um, before. Matter of fact, friend. let me see what it looked like before, just, just for reference. I think it was I this one. I'm gonna show y'all what 500 plus yeah. hours look like on Disney Dreamlight Valley. We are all uh family. yeah it looks a lot family. like that it's you know just more junky Disney and game loft. we are all a big happy family right? so i want to show y'all my island man it's very junky compared to what i want to do now i want to make it less junky it do look good though i put a tree in the middle wait where am i go back to the town bro <laughs> it's crazy that my island has changed so much so many times it looks so bare now though that looks good Honestly, I almost want to say this look better than it look now. We had the little Halloween neighborhood. That was a vibe. I'm not going to lie. That was a vibe. The side where my house is looks a little bit better, but I, I wouldn't say that it. And then we got the pumpkin patch, which we completely made that better. And I want to see what this looks like. Yeah, so I just, I kind of junked it up a little bit, which I definitely wouldn't do this time. Like putting Buzz Lightyear and all that out there. I did like the outhouses in the corner, though. That looks good right there. And what about Cheers and Remy? Didn't I have Cheers and Remy right there? Yeah, okay. Cheers and Remy was right there. So where Mickey and Minnie is used to be the restaurant. The plaza and everything looks so much nicer. <laughs> that plaza went through hell, yo. This plaza be going through hell. And then down here, down here was nice, too. It's more low-key. We definitely got to fix this up, yo. How am I going backwards with my designs? All right, that's enough. That's enough. By the way, did y'all see that that new house? It's actually, or was it? It was a couple days ago they dropped it. I think it might have been this one. I don't know if anybody noticed it or not, but if you did, so this is, matter of fact, maybe it's anything I didn't notice. All right, we got the magic doorknob. I forgot about uh, Encanto. I got to bring her in. Let's see if there's anything in the background. Nah, uh, nothing. See, a lot of times with this stuff, you got to really be looking in the background. Wait, I think I just saw something. I think I just saw something, bruh. This. What building is this? This is not in the game right now. See, this is what I'm talking about. You really got to look in the background. What is this building? That building is not in the game. And that's not Scrooge's. Is that Scrooge's before you upgrade it to the big time? I don't think so. It might be, though. That might be Scrooge's before you update it. We got to start doing this when these drop. I mean, I'm just doing it in the middle because I'm rocking with y'all. Y'all rocking with me, but I really need to do these like when they come out so we can get more viewers. It's really, it's really dope that y'all rocking with me though. Look at this, man. This is, this is not huge, but it's decent. It's decent. I can work with that. Got to get them pants. Mickey and Minnie. No, nah, cause see that Scrooge's store right there. See, unless that might have been that building. I think that might have been because this looks like the exact same architecture. I think that green building was Scrooge's, but that's not what I'm talking about though. It's coming up. It's actually coming up. See that right there. This house right here is not in the game yet. So this is going to be either coming to the item shop or this is going to be coming as an update. I think this is going to be an item shop. I think because they, they say item shop. So I think this is going to be in the item shop. And honestly, this is a nice crib. This is a nice crib. It's way more like quaint and way. Is, it, is this the house that was in the trailer from before? Not the trailer, but the login screen. It almost looked like it, though. This is a nice house, though. I mean, I think that... um. I'm going to keep the palace just because it's so rich and I got the whole plot of land. But like for more of a cozy feel, this is definitely it. Yeah, let's get another view of that. And we're going to hop back in the game. Yeah, I think this was the house that was on the art for this game. And I was telling y'all it was a house that kind of looked like a, a cottage thing. This might have been it. I thought it was a different character. Yeah, and then the castle. Let me see if I, what I'm talking about is, is accurate or not. Wait, they show stuff in this trailer that we ain't got yet. See, look at this. This building right here. We don't have that. They're going to show it again. This right here. That's from Tangle. This is definitely from Tangle. We haven't gotten that yet. It's crazy how much stuff they hide in plain sight sometimes. Okay, that's the church. I'm specifically looking for a building. Okay, that was Scrooge's. See, that's Scrooge's building. I forgot what it used to look like. It's been so long. I remember when this game first came out, I was like, oh, yo, she a cute character till I made Disney Bay. Disney Bay tops all, you know what I'm saying? Disney Bay is out here. This game is so good, though. I forgot, like, how it felt when I first played it. Now, look, 
What is this? What is this brick apartment looking building? Is that Remy's? That looked like a little apartment building. I don't know what this is, but I'm liking that. Can y'all see that? You see this building right here? What is this building right here? That's looking like an apartment building. It kind of looked like Remy's though at the bottom, but I don't know if that's Remy's. And of course we, we got some of them coming soon. Nah, this is definitely not Remy's or is it? Did Remy's used to look like this? The apartment building though. This building is right here, right above the, the thing. The mouse was that that building that can't be that building that's a new building but it could be before development because look eric's house looks different too so they might have made that that building and decided to go with it to make it look like that that's a possibility because this is like early trailer yeah see this building right here that has to be remy's house they just changed it up and hey, that'd be cool if we could live in an apartment building see this right here this house right here has been hidden was hidden in plain sight for so long this house that's not that same house or is it that is that same house so this might be our house in the future this isn't gonna be a villager's house this is gonna be our house variation of our house <sighs> I do like this though. I think we're gonna I think we're gonna stick with this. I wanna hey, um sure see something though. I wanna see if we can widen this up some. Cause this walkway is kind of thin. See, I don't know though, because you got all these trees right here. And if I widen this up too much, it's gonna be off center, ain't it? So if I widen it this way, is that gonna look dumb? Or is that gonna look alright? Cause that's the way I had it. If I widen it up more, it's not gonna be centered. So when you walk out, it's not don't gonna be I don't know, Olaf. You tell me. Summer seems a little iffy if you're a snowman. Well, I think if I open it up, it'll be all right. I just don't like this grass. This grass looks so unmanaged. It looks like hood grass. Like, y'all know them, them houses, like, down the way, like, they just don't have nobody to cut the grass, and they always have long grass. And even when they cut the grass, the grass is cut long, so it just always looks bad. That's what that grass looks like to me. So I prefer not to have grass showing. Let's see it from the other way. It just looks like it's off center now a little bit though. But we gonna add stuff to it. We might add some carts and like, cause we want it to feel not too secluded, but not too commercial. We want it to be a nice combination of like, okay, Disneyland vibes. I think, I think we all right. I think we all right widen it up. Let me get this stuff out the way so I can actually widen it up. I really hope in the future they add little stuff like the capability to change like different grass materials and cut the grass. And I mean, not that we can cut the grass, but like different grass lengths. That would be cool. I mean, that's, that's really far down the road, but I'm just saying though, I mean, they, they was bold enough to charge people $20 basically for items that are like irrelevant. So I'm hoping they brave enough to do some of the things that i'm talking about like this far-fetched like relationships with a customizable character i'm not gonna give y'all my ideas but my other ideas as well <laughs> you know what i'm saying like i just want disney bay to be like my companion and be walking around with her that would be so dope you could pick a a uh trait now whether or not they do that i doubt it but it would be cool if they did i mean if we're going far-fetched right i mean i would pay you know what I'm saying y'all want money right i would pay for that i would pay for that how much would i pay for that i would pay i pay a hundred dollars for that what a hundred dollars yep i would pay a hundred dollars to have a customizable companion that you could make your girlfriend or if you want a boyfriend or whatever you want you could make your own custom companion that's a human i would pay more than a hundred but i'm saying a hundred is a decent price for like an expansion pack because you could have whatever you wanted even if you didn't want a relationship type thing you could just have a friend that looks how you want them to look that would be fun now what if i went just one over so that that means it's still centered if i just went one over it's still centered yeah i think one is good i think one is good we still got a little bit of something right here I don't think I'm going to put these in right now. I think that's going to look good. I like that. And then we could also add some trees to this side. You know, we're we, we going to make it feel right. We're going to make it feel right. I'm just trying to see. Is this center? This is center. Oh, the store is off center. If I recall, the store can't be center, right? Yeah, it can't. Because technically that's center. The store is off center. That's another thing I like to see them fix. The ability to place things in quarter tiles where even if something that has an odd number of tiles it could still be centered because that's annoying for somebody like me that likes everything symmetrical you got to pick one way or another yeah see like that see that would never go in between there which is cool but if you did quarter tiles or one eighth tiles or how many tiles you got to do you could squeeze it 
right in between there and have it centered and have it uh centered. But for right now, it's fine. Nobody's really gonna notice that. No way. Look how perfect the pillars go together. They almost look like that was one pillar. I'm just trying to get my layout together so I can start building on it. Cause I definitely don't want to bring the merry-go-round or nothing like down here i think that's just gonna kill the vibe i want to make that a christmas happy arcadey type thing up there i think that's gonna be better in the long run let's see what that merry-go-round look like in the plaza i already did i didn't like it yeah, it's it's okay i wouldn't knock it but if, if you need other stuff though so like when they give us the, the amusement park stuff i'm hoping that's what that is uh then we should be able to make a little bit more of an amusement park look. I definitely want to put my outhouses back over there, though. I like that outhouse look. So I'm gonna throw my outhouses back over there. I think that was a, I think that was a better idea. Sometimes you gotta tear it up and, and use some of the recycled ideas because some of them was just W ideas. So I'm definitely gonna do that. I like that little cut for those outhouses. Now this is a bridge. Now that's the interesting part. This is a bridge, and I don't know how much of this do I want to really entertain or do I want to just kind of pretend that that's not a bridge and that's not there because sometimes that's what you got to do yo look at this idea I mean I don't know if I'd really want to do this but it don't look as dumb up here as I thought it would Moana's fish market up here I mean it don't it don't make a whole lot of sense but it make a little bit of sense because first of all the beach is right there so she could just come up here to sell her fish in the market district which is what this is that actually is not a bad idea i don't think nobody's ever done that it also is right next to remy's so she could supply remy's with i, I kind of like that idea i'm stealing everything from the plaza just making the plaza look terrible i'm not uh i'm not i'm not opposed to doing this though i kind of like this i just was tired of the same old look on the beach man like i mean the beach is cool i like the beach but it needs to be re revamped definitely needs a little bit of revamps because it's like the same look as i've had for a long time i'm just saying though is this really something i want to do i almost think it is i almost want to say it is i don't know if i'm gonna bring any of this other stuff up here or not but maybe maybe a couple tiki torches just to bring the moana let's grab a couple more tiki torches the real beachy ones i kind of like this idea this was a cool idea just now yeah I like this. And then we could just stick some of these, you know what I mean? Kind of just add a little bit more light. What about the chest? How you feel about the chest? The chest kind of makes sense because it's like an ice chest. And these these are light. So she might have carried the fish up here in the ice chest. The little flame thing I think can go though. That's not really making a whole lot of sense. And put that down there. The cart would be cool too. As if she carried the cart up here with the fish on it or had Maui do it. That's even better. She had Maui do it. <laughs> That's W story right there. W story. She had Maui. Damn. Get the camera together, bruh. What's going on? She had Maui carry this cart upstairs up the ramp. I just wanted to see what Maui looked like next to the car. Yeah, he could definitely carry that. I don't think we're going to have a statue of Maui up here, though. I think that's too much. Is that too much? Yeah, that's too much. We ain't going to have a statue of him. Wait, why is that? Oh, shit. I'm messing up. Yeah, W idea, man. W idea. I like this. I like this. And then she's kind of just part of the market district. We just make this whole little square. The market, market square. I like that. I was just sitting around trying to come up with different ideas. And that one popped in. Just little stuff. I'm just trying to see. They still ain't made Eric's thing any better, huh? Eric's statue would be a cool item, but it's just like, it's so bad of a pose. I don't think I'm ever going to use it. Of course, I'm going to steal a lot of benches and stuff like that, but I'm just like looking around a little bit, seeing if anything sticks out. I don't know if I'm going to do something like this where I make the sidewalk like trees. I do like that kind of vibe. It gives it a little bit more life. I don't know if I'm going to do that though. I'm about to see how that looks when I get down on the ground level so much has to be cleaned up look at all these night thorns this is ridiculous man i'm gonna redo this whole i'm gonna redo this whole meadow and plaza they're gonna both get redone but that's not really my concern right now my concern right now is sunlit and forest of valor and frosted heights those are my concerns right now and i'm thinking look at look at forest of valor coming right back to life after i had completely made it look like just a forest look at it it's looking good too it's looking good i like that carved out feel where like you see trees but you see where it's carved out 
too like i like that i think i'm gonna make this part still a forest though i don't think i have enough to like something here too unless some of y'all got an idea or i can come up with an idea because the only characters we really got left is eric which he ain't gonna look right in the in this area i mean we could make him work but he really don't belong in this biome he really don't he's more like beach or sunlit plateau you know with the palm trees i could make a more exclusive transporter area that i could do make something a little bit more special than just right on the corner i could do that this is like a beach house right yeah that's not gonna work you know i could put little mermaid where i got maui and that little mermaid would be right next to eric yo does that make more sense because where do i have maui at because i never think about putting these people in different areas but you technically can put them wherever you want like maui could be nah he can't he can't he can be up in that pond up here though he can definitely go in here which is definitely unique but i was thinking like why do that if we can put little mermaid next to eric that makes more sense for the storyline like he built her a palace next to his palace i mean how does that look i wouldn't say it looks the best but it makes sense for the storyline because eric you got to be a mermaid sometime it's cool let me build you a spot right next to my spot i don't know i don't know we still we still thinking on that one moana stand on the beach for sure plus it makes sense because her little market thing is right there damn i think we pretty much then exerted all the y'all want to rock the hottest merch in the game well go over to samedaniel.com slash shop man where you can get all the new merch that i drop i got hoodies t-shirts pillows phone cases coming lanyards all kind of stuff man so go over to samedaniel.com slash shop get the hottest merch man i got it on right now because it's just so fly also if you want my uncensored sim videos you want access to all my content before it hits youtube and some content that never hits youtube that's strictly exclusive you gotta go over to the only fans man let's get back into the video the idea is right now yo we've exerted a lot of ideas now we just gotta make them look right feel right do a lot of polishing on them so first let's see does this do these trees look right in here let's see that if i put trees or bushes this one's gonna be too much i think throw that one over there let's just see how that feels and let's check out how moana's feels too what is this fountain still doing here <laughs> I swear some of these glitches bruh okay the trees ain't really in the way too much i think they're off center though it didn't save any of that what i just did i think the trees in the middle actually give it a little bit of character i like the trees in the middle and then it opens up this tree ain't supposed to be here either but it opens up into the plaza damn did anything save everything is backwards like what is going on man this is supposed to be like that this was over here they gotta get these glitches together man because i swear some of this stuff is like unacceptable like i just did all that with that stuff and none of it saved none of the torches saved none of that okay that's moana's spot now take this fountain put it somewhere else it destroyed my pavement for some reason put this tree over here none of that saved like literally nothing i did saved that's crazy i mean it ain't gotta be perfectly spaced out i'm just trying to get an idea now this is gonna be moana's little area I do need to get these pillars out the way too. But how does it look being Moana being up here? It actually looks pretty cool though. Hey, look at this. You can see the beach from up here too. I actually really like that. That's a good idea. I don't know about these lemon trees either. They a little bit in the way. Stuff is a little tight up here right now. It's a little tight. You know, I'm. it's a possibility. I don't know how probable it is, but it's a possibility that I take these up and don't use these here. It's a, prob it's a possibility. It's not a probability. It's a possibility. Because I just don't know. It's a very it's a very tight area, honestly. I might do lemon trees down this whole block. It's a little tight here. And then, of course, I'm going to move these pillars. They're going to be like in the back of the store or something like that. Move this tree over for a little bit and then they could be like i don't know on the side or something just to give it a little bit of substantialness without being in the way let's just move these lemon trees so i could see how this feels with those out the way and those pillars out the way let me just see how this is feeling this van is a little too much i think too i think we're gonna move the van maybe we'll make it like a little rv area over there like in the woods a little rv area in the woods might be dope actually like we'll wood this off again and then make like a little camp area maybe a little picnic area i don't know i always like having a truck in with the town so it gives it that like towny look but also like room to walk around and i don't know if we can have both right now i'm just trying to 
give myself a little bit more room so that's cool that's cool that gave me a little bit more room i don't know if i'm keeping these trees where they are but that's cool though i like that i like that these little mickeys i just kind of brought them up here i don't know where they going yet i don't know exactly where i want to put them take the lemon trees take them away let's just see let's see okay <laughs> It's still kind of small though. I feel like this area is a lot smaller than it should be. And I think it's because of these big topiary things. They just take up a lot of space. And that's why I'm thinking I might take these up. Plus I use them everywhere. So I might take them up, make a little tree area here instead. I'm gonna do a little bit of polishing off camera a little bit. Just a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I like to do a little designing with y'all, but then I also like to do a little designing off camera. That way I can just like throw on music and just kind of think of stuff. But I'm definitely liking how this is coming out. I like the trees in the middle. I think I want to work on something over here because this area right here is just looking too, it's just out of place. You know what I'm saying? Everything looks good from this angle though. I like this angle. And then this right here just looks great. Yeah, that right there looks great. Let's get both of them in the picture. <laughs> Moana always looked jealous as hell at Disney Bay. She either looked jealous or looked like she in love. One of the two. All right, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and pause this episode here, man. This has been a W design video. I'm not going to lie. Next one, I think we're going to start working on the snow biome because we definitely got some ideas up there. Keep it Christmassy. I should be able to polish this off a little bit more, get a little bit more ideas how I want to do this. I think already I'm noticing what I want to do here is actually take this down. I think what I want to do here is take this and curve it. We could, we could leave a little opening though leave a little opening so we can still get over there but i definitely think i want to do something like this and i don't know how that works for them outhouses maybe a little beaten path maybe we'll do a beaten path right there because you definitely want the outhouses to be paved off this is going to be a, a, a well-traveled area i could just go down with it couldn't i yeah you know what I could do that. I could do this right here. And then if you want, you could still get to this bridge, go across. I'll make that like a beaten path, maybe kind of like the little mulch thing. I just don't know what I'm going to do with this entire area right here. I'm thinking camping grounds, but I mean, how big can you? Oh, yeah, I guess you can make camping grounds pretty big. We don't have no tents or nothing, though. Tents would definitely be helpful for that. We got the balloons. Maybe we could work something out with them. Farmy like tent light could possibly do the water towers but i don't know about that i mean it kind of makes sense because this is like a fresh water type place you could store water in it that's that's a possibility oh, we definitely could do some of this though like we could do a little campgrounds and then we could have a little layout for the picnics the only downside is there's only one truck but that's okay we could we could we could maybe make some stuff up maybe had a the truck but then maybe had like a little nah the spaceship ain't gonna look right we could have some bikes have a little bike situation the rv some picnic areas maybe even had this in the middle of it i don't know something something i think i think we're gonna do that though i think i like the rv idea that's not a bad idea i'm not set on it yet but i'm thinking that might be a good idea though might could do a little clock tower it was like a clock tower a fountain type thing all mulched off so all of this will be like mulch mulch trees i don't know we'll see we'll see i love y'all pace let me know in the comments what you think about this though man i'm curious to see what y'all say about my new market district i think it's looking good i think it needs polished a little bit and uh some of this stuff might need to be moved around a little bit like i just moved that tree out the way all in all i think this is gonna come out really good and i love the castle the castle they gave us is definitely a w idea i just hope that they drop the prices because them prices is crazy but if they don't or if they do i'm still gonna be doing the videos before you buy every time so and like was it one day or two days i'll be doing another one so hopefully they got some new good items oh yeah it refreshes in 41 hours so yeah we'll be doing that in 41 hours for sure so i'm just sitting here taking these braids out because i'm about to get myself some new fresh braids you know what i'm saying so i was just sitting here doing this but i wanted to show y'all like look man look at what i did right here this is better this is 100 percent better than the topiary bushes i put the big two oak trees right up here i'm using my right hand to do this left hand to do this yeah 
multitasking. Those trees look so much better than the topiary bushes because they give you like that height. You know what I'm saying? That height is really important. Plus, I'm, I'm going to make this look nicer. I'm going to put a little bit more effort into this. But I'm definitely liking how this is coming out right now. Just a minute ago, I was working on Mickey's patio because I want to make Mickey's little patio right here. You know what I'm saying? You see what I'm doing? You know what I mean? Look at that. Look at that. That's looking good right there, yeah. It's looking like a little patio oasis over there for Mickey and Minnie. I'm going to add a little bit more back here like trees and stuff like that. Or at least some bushes, I think. Let's see what the bushes look like. I think I'm going to go with the... Uh, which bushes? I think I'm gonna go with these. One of these. Damn, I can't put that back there. Well, yeah, I can. I can put one. Forest of Valor one. And then, like, just to kind of give it a little bit of privacy. We'll give it a little privacy. But, yeah, man, I'm going to pause this episode and just continually doing what I'm doing. But, like, it's coming along nice, though. And maybe I'll come back, like, after I get my hair braided. I don't know. But it's looking good, though. I'm definitely liking I like these trees. They gave the, the forest a little bit more color. I think instead of going with all these dark green ones, I'm going to bring a little bit more light ones in here just to give it more vibrant because sometimes the woods be looking a little bit too dark and gloomy and that looked cool when we was going for the wood look but for right now we want to go with that bright airy you know friendly type feel and that's looking good over there it's definitely looking good so this is what i feel like my hair would look like if i got it locked up if i got some dreads I think it would look a lot more like this. So like the hair would be fuller. You know what I'm saying? I think I'm going to, man. I told you, I, my homie Gerard, he got a girl, does his. I'm like, yo, I might just have to go. At least try it. I think I'm going to try it before I cut it, but I don't know. I say that, and then the next thing you know, I'll be cutting my hair off. So we'll see. feel like Michael Jackson. Just got the braids done, you know what I'm saying? Looking real fresh, looking real fresh. She touching my da -da, All of my da, -da, da That's been stuck in my head the whole damn time I was doing that. She's touching her da, -da, -da. She's doing da, -da, -da. Okay, let's see. I was just trying to make the, the little square, like, perfect. Oh, yeah, I need to move this out. Okay. Yeah, I'm just trying to make this look real official on these squares. See what I'm saying? See, that's looking real nice, man. That's looking real nice. That's really looking like Disney Dream Parks right there. She said it, I'm good enough. What am I? Da -da -da. Da -da 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 -da. My new glasses. I ain't got them made yet, but I like these. These glasses is real official. I got to get these made. I want to have a big collection of prescription glasses so I can stop wearing contacts so much. Because, my ma'am, I feel like now when I wear contacts, like, they dry up. I feel like they dry up in, like, three hours. Three hours, I'm like, I got to take these out. And I've been wearing dailies thinking it was going to be better, but I almost feel like the dailies is worse because the problem with the dailies is that they are bigger contact lenses. So I feel like they soak the damn oxygen out of your eye sockets. You like the little crib I made for you, bruh? See your, see your little backyard back here, man? You and Minnie can get it on, you know what I'm saying? Little backyard. I love that little backyard area. But I go Minnie. What's her dress? Her dress was always polka dot, right? Bro, I swear this game is going to make me lose my damn mind. Because I think I know what something looks like until I see it. And then I really look at it and I'm like, was it always like that? Minnie's outfit was always all polka dot, right? See, now I'm tripping. It was always all polka dot. Why do I feel like her shirt was a different color before? Why do I feel that way? Let me see. What, what was I doing? I wanted to see what Mickey's styles was. Because he got, all right, his Christmas one and then this new one. I still feel like his eyes are like off. I think it's because his eye, like, see how her, her eyes are just like on her face? His eyes are like poked out from his face you see what i'm saying see how they like bulging out of his head where hers hers is like right on her face like they're in her head like eyes are supposed to be you see what i'm saying look at that they're actually in her head you could actually see that they're in her head it's like a little bit of skin and in her eyes mickey's joints mickey's joints are like bulging out of his head or at least it looks like they're bulging out of his head i don't even know i know this rain be killing my vibe though but i'm gonna go ahead and pause this episode anyway eric out here playing the flute eric i really dislike you bro i ain't gonna lie <laughs> He like, well, what I what I do, yo? Yeah? I'm like, what do you say? Fuck me for? Yeah, Olaf running around. Olaf, you need to go up in the snow biome. I'm always decorating outside the crib. Let's go in there and just look real quick. I think it's still hooked up for Christmas, so I definitely could like spend some time in here. Let's just see some real quick. This was like stuck in here. I couldn't delete it. Oh, you can move the doors now. That's dope. 
they did like offset them a little bit. See, that's weird. That just show you right there that they need to do a, a quarter tile because these are offset. This is really cool though. Can you delete? You can replace the door. Oh, with any of the other doors. Okay, okay. I see you, Disney. You, 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 uh, you changing up a little bit. I feel that. So like that. Yeah. Now, I don't know. Like, I do like that dining room right there. I love these, this, this Christmas theme. It's just, oh, you know what else is cool? Now that I can move this over, let's get these gifts out of here. Y'all want to do it? Y'all want to do it this episode? Why not? Why not? Why not just do it right now while I'm in here? I need to get rid of something. I don't want to get rid of something, but I think I need to get rid of something. I mean, it's, Christmas is over. I got to get rid of Christmas. As much as I don't want to, I have to. What I was going to say, though, is now that you can move the doors over, I can move everything over and put a corner counter in and actually make this make this work. What is counters considered? Storage? No. Tables? I need a corner piece. Damn, that ain't the right one. What is that, black and black? Black and black? Damn, I don't have a black and black corner piece, huh? I'm always buying counters and I don't have a black on black corner? That says black. Black corner with all oh, with gray marble top. I need a black marble top. Yeah, I need a gray marble top. But you see what I'm saying? See, now I could actually make this combine like that see look at that and if i wanted see changing the door placement was a big deal interior wise because now you can actually do things like i can make a living room like 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 <laughs> like say this was um a living room i could pull the door all the way over here and make all of this space a living room instead of being stuck with this door in the middle this area is really cool i like the double kitchen look i think that's a cool look but i just don't know if i don't know if um i don't know this damn camera just fell i don't know if i want to do full kitchen like i don't know man what i'm thinking though this door is too big this door is too big as much as i like it it's just too big um i gotta get with the smaller door and it's gotta go right there i really like the dining room look but i gotta get rid of christmas i really hate to get rid of christmas y'all y'all don't understand christmas is so dope to me it's the best holiday ever it just feels good it's everything about it is great but it's got to go because it is no longer christmas time damn this whole table is a christmas table wait a minute why can't i delete it there must be something on it oh each one of these plates i didn't even realize that and then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get rid of these we got to man we got to i really don't want to like i truly truly don't want to but we have to man we have to i mean this is the main room we can't have the main room decorated for christmas all year round i really need to get rid of these windows too as much as i don't want to do that they're too christmas oriented damn it's dead as hell in here now now i mean there's multiple items that i need to flex there's multiple items i need to flex because they cost too much money not to flex and these items are chandelier that's a nice looking chandelier these pillars are already flexed heavily throughout the these uh windows are beautiful i love these windows this grandfather clock see i don't know if i'm gonna be able to flex these in here this is a small room i'm not sure if that's a flex or not i forgot how you gonna forget your flexes i don't know but some of them we just kind of forgot see i don't know the main room is such an important room because the main room is literally where you need to be quick cook but now things are a little different because now we have the bigger uh chess we have we just have more stuff now so now instead of having to worry about all these big storage rooms i could do a lot in this one room without taking up all this space and i'm still not sure if i'm going to do that or not and look at this pixelated window that's kind of cool triangle window a lot of stuff i bought that i just forgot i bought where are the items i just bought though this is really why they're not worth it they don't even organize the damn items for you it should be a section purchased it should definitely be a section purchased because i don't even remember what i bought oh, i know it's a bedroom set wasn't it foliage this was new no that's not new wait where is the plant i just bought oh is it because i threw it i think it's because it's upstairs hold up hold up i'm not um well, i gotta save it i was i was gonna go back and not save it but i got to let me go up to floor two real quick and grab all them expensive items yeah here they go see i need to get these put them in my inventory so then i could actually use them because there's no way in hell i'm not using these items in my main room 
There's no way. Items cost too much money, bruh. Okay, okay, let's see. Now they should be the last thing in here because usually that's how it is. It's like the last thing you got. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so I'll use this, the Princess Princess Diana, Princess and the Frog Shelf. Um, Definitely maybe the gold chair, definitely this TV stand. Use the light too if we can table if we can the bed i'm gonna have to wait i'm gonna have to do that in the bedroom setting the plant for sure and then any of the new flexes which the new flexes i mean the old flexes and the old flexes is the gold set which is those chairs grandfather clock i don't know where all of that is but it should be in here somewhere that's the old flex though new flex is these new these new items so it says it refreshes in 12 hours now i don't know why it was saying 24 or 48 or whatever earlier whenever it refreshes y'all will know because i'm gonna put a video out no matter what because i feel like that's a good like that's a good thing to do man it's always good to give people things business wise it's always good to provide people with a service that's like a good business model if you ever think about starting a business you always want to start a business based on giving people a service and i know that's like the whole idea of starting a business but like think about it think about only fans think of the service that them girls provide for lonely dudes and lonely girls Think about YouTubers, streamers. What do they provide for you? They provide entertainment. They provide company. They provide comfort. You see what I'm saying? What do some YouTube channels provide? They provide tutorials. They provide knowledge. You see what I'm saying? So for me, I'm always just being myself on here kicking it with y'all because y'all provide for me as much as I provide for you. You see what I'm saying? And see, not a lot of YouTubers are like that. But see, with me, y'all give me an outlet to be me and in return people find comfort and like value and entertainment in me doing that with y'all so we both are benefiting off of each other damn that's gonna crop through that door disney you're gonna have to do better than that bruh you want to compete with the sims you're gonna have to get that cropping and all that you're gonna have to fix that i ain't gonna get on you too hard because you know still early development but you're gonna have to fix that bruh, bruh. uh what do we need to do here though see i'm not really good at designing like in these kind of situations this is like when a designer is really necessary i feel like because like with me i'm good at symmetrical couch tv you know what i'm saying tv center plants on the edge couch in the middle coffee table do the end tables i'm not really good at like a corner decorate a corner off center that kind of stuff really is like i hit a brick wall every time um but right now i mean that's just kind of threw that together it's not terrible it's not good either but it's not terrible and they got to get this this symmetrical thing down like i mean look at this this is this is unacceptable <laughs> this is unacceptable i should be able to center that yo i don't even think we need this to be honest uh i mean is that cool what about the other items though that come from the pack where's the other items like the chair oh there they go see this chair ain't gonna match nothing neither is that nightstand well i guess i took the plant from that then took most of the stuff from the gold one what was the other pack the castle and then what what was the other pack oh i'm tripping so the bedroom set is actually that table and light and then the living room is the chair wow those are so overpriced it's crazy i mean i knew that because i already did the video but it's just like thinking about it these all together shouldn't have been worth what one of those was and you can't even watch the tv if you could watch the tv i would say yeah like if they played like how in the sims they had a tv on if you could just have a tv on playing disney movies that which i'm thinking they're gonna have to they're gonna have to upgrade some stuff like that in the future this isn't bad though this is the idea that i'm going with i'm definitely gonna have to work on new inventory rooms though because these inventory rooms are not even necessary anymore i have so much i have so many things that are like full and each one of these is a third of what one is so that means all three of these could be one and then four which is uh seven so one two three four five six seven just from here to here would take this entire room and some actually seven chests would fill this entire room so i could actually only have one room for inventory now instead of having a pantry which is what this was uh i'm not sure if i'm gonna do that or not because these rooms are so 
well made right now and I like the way they laid out. I don't know if those new chests are going to have a good layout system with how I got the shelves because I don't like them signs. I think those signs are lame. I mean, I know what they were trying to do and they, you know, they work for some people, but they're not working for me. This room here, though, is nice. I like this room. Got my materials. One of these is empty, right? Yeah, this one. See, this ain't going to fit right. This ain't going to look right. Let me just move this out of the way. Put this over here. And then we pause in this episode because I've been all over the place this episode. But y'all love Disney videos, man. I'm not even going to lie. I never thought this game would get this kind of support, but I love y'all for real. That's why I love every one of y'all comments because, like, I really want you to know I appreciate you for real, for real. That is no BS, you know what I'm saying? That's real. And that's my way of trying to, you know what I'm saying, validate everybody that's uh, posting. So this is what the new chest would look like, a bunch of those. But if you look, we're just testing a couple theories real quick. I like to have something that's sitting up. A table, that ain't going to work. See, I like the counter because the counter gives you four. Was this a counter? Yeah, that was an island. The island gave you four. See, none of this stuff is, this is only one item worth. This would be cool if you could stick the chest up under there, wouldn't it? I know you ain't going to be able to do that. Yeah, I didn't. I mean, I didn't know. I was. I, I had a little bit of hope, a little bit of hope. The side table, that's already got something on it. Coffee table, I don't even trust that coffee table. That's another table, that's too big. These are too low. So I don't think nothing is going to be... See, the island, that's the best one, the island. I mean, you could always do it anyway and just have it lower, but I like it to be even. That whole evened out thing really makes this unique yeah that's that's it that's a wrap i mean what you think about that that don't that don't look terrible but then something like sand that's never gonna fit on there it only holds one square and that ain't gonna work well it could work because i could do like boom that represents minerals and then have all the gold but that don't look nearly okay what about what about just putting it what if i just put it where it was and it was just lower i mean that's not bad it's definitely not bad but it's nowhere near as cool as scrooges i don't understand why they wouldn't make scrooges important i mean i guess you could kind of cheat your way into getting these because i think all you gotta do is scrooges quest but like they're so elite they're gold they're shiny you know what i'm saying like they're literally a vault which for diamonds and stuff is really cool but it looks like we're gonna have to move everything into there because i mean look at this man you cannot beat this amount of storage i mean it almost is dumb for me to have this much like right here we have three chests for fish that could be condensed to one here we have four chests for crystals that's probably gonna get condensed to two most likely most likely because what's that two four six and these are three right wait that's more how many is that that's one two three four five six seven eight two four six so six times eight this is one two three four five six seven eight oh i don't know it just looked bigger for some reason that's eight two by six yeah okay they the same i might need two for my gems two for my gems one for my fish one for my flowers that's gonna be so much more helpful for flowers uh uh, probably I probably do dirt rock dirt rock and cold these all go in one sticks maybe dirt rock coal and sticks then we'll do minerals uh, I need to put sand in there with dirt I'm gonna probably do that off camera though because I feel like that's gonna be kind of boring just organizing the, the inventory so I might do that off camera I don't know. Sometimes I don't know what y'all want me to do on camera and what you don't. I know a lot of people play their game while I'm playing, so it's kind of cool to do stuff like that. So we'll see. But I love y'all. Peace. That was amazing. Hey, go check out Sunny D. It's like the drink. Sunny D. Hey. All of those long, hard hours of work definitely pay off. Hey. I see that. I see that. Sunny Daniel Enterprises.